Good evening. We're now seeing the moments before a state police officer opened fire on a pair of brothers, killing one of them. It was a wild scene as the brothers kept charging the officer and screaming at him. Here's News 13 Stephanie Chavez. Lizé, the officer, was helping on a separate call in Los Lunas last month when he spotted a driver flying through a stop sign. I got a vehicle, it looks like a great Pontiac, and then I out of everyone. Just ran the stop sign, traveling at high rate of speed, I'm trying to catch up to it to come stuff out. Officer Gayton started following the brothers, who eventually veered off on the ditch bank. That's when Ruben and Alonso de Leon got out of the car and start antagonizing the officer. One of them even throwing his shirt at the officer. The brothers clapping and egging on Officer Miguel Gayton, beating on their chests and challenging him to fight. The officer tased Ruben, but pulled out the prongs. After a couple minutes, the brothers started forcing the officer backwards, so he fired a couple of shots, hitting both of them and killing Ruben de Leon. The lapel and dash cam didn't pick up any of the audio from the confrontation, but when backup arrives on scene, Officer Gayton explains what happened. Yeah, they just ran the stop sign, bro. They're flying, so I, they crashed. They kept coming at me. I tased one of them. The entire confrontation was captured on cell phone video by neighbors who were concerned about the officer's safety. They called police asking them to send for help. The car is in our field and the police officer has two men. Uh, I believe he needs backup immediately. Emergency. He had to shoot him. Ruben de Leon, who was 25, died at the scene. His 38 year old brother, Alonso, is still behind bars. Back to you. Okay, Stephanie, Alonso has a long criminal record. Police say he also threw a pair of knives into the irrigation canal, which a state police dive team recovered.